see my favorite person. We have finally arrived at the day of our wedding. I remember how far away this seemed to feel, but here we are, hours away from committing ourselves to each other forever. On June 21st, 2018, the Lord breathed a new peace in me that I'd never felt before. My heart stopped wandering because you are the one I've been praying for. I am still in awe of the blessing that is your hand in marriage, and I'm so wonderfully in love with you. I love you more than I thought possible. You are truly my heart's desire and my soul's delight. So Lorna, you may or may not know that while you were living in Korea, Jake developed a plan to visit you there and have a conversation in the name of closure. <laughs> now, I don't usually shut Jake's ideas down, but this one needed to be put to rest. This is true for two reasons. One, he would have had one shot to end things on a good note. But the second thing is that the Lord wasn't having any part of that closure idea, and neither was I. And no conversation on closure could have ever been as great as the doors our Lord was preparing to reopen. A year ago, Lorna told me Jacob emailed her out of the blue to meet up. After years of not talking, I completely entrusted God because in his hands, no matter what was to come, it would be good. You are even more so ready now for the purpose God has in mind together than you ever would have been apart from one another. Lorna, we represent an extension of Jacob. He and we love your union. You should know that you are a gift to Jake, to his family, to his friendships, all for the betterment of his life. And Jacob, I am beyond thankful the Lord brought you into our life. <laughs> Jacob, you are my most prized friend. You are the epitome of greatness. I am selfish about the gift that I find in your brotherhood. You are master of the king. You guys were amazing, and together it, it's multiplied. So I love you both. I bless you guys in Jesus' name. So we raise a glass in congratulation and in love. With all the love in the world, cheers to your Bikingdom. To Lord and Jacob. To the Bikings. Cheers to Mr. and Mrs. Biking. Father, we just thank you for this day, God. Um, we rejoice in it. It's the day that you have made. And so we just stand here celebrating the coming together of two lives to become one for Jacob and for Lorna, God. And we just thank you, God, for your blessing upon this day. This marriage today is a great thing. And so, God, we just commit today to you, God, for your glory and for your honor. And it's in Jesus' name we pray. Amen.
Lorna, I join my life to yours. That leads to a shared life. Not what I can get, but what I can give. I give you my life. I lay it down for you. And I find my new life in you. Lorna. Jacob. I choose to love and cherish you. With everything in me. From this day forward. For as long as we both shall live. For as long as we both shall live. By virtue of the authority vested in me by the state of California, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Jacob, you may now kiss your bride.